What's up guys, it's your boy the Dragon into PD here and welcome to a new video of KOTOR 2. So let's go where we where we left. And you know, let's continue the story. You seem pretty calm. It's almost streaming off of you. A lot calmer than you were on Paragus when I first met you. I'm in fact. I haven't felt this good in a long time. Well, it's good to see. You're a nice counterbalance to that old witch back there. <laughs> okay, thanks, mate. To that old witch back there. Okay. So first I want to talk some more with the people here. And after that I want to, you know, go to Citadel Station because I think there's more to do there. But after that I'll go to... What's it called? Underarm. Yes. Or dead twin, I don't know. Can I ask you some questions? May I ask? Uh, why do you look different than your sisters? I honor the face of my mother. It is not something usually spoken of in the... So you have a different mother, but the same father. I do not wish to discuss it. If there is something else you wish to ask, you may do so. Uh, is it, uh, I apologize, and I know offense. There is no need to apologize. You were merely remarking on something that you saw. Oh shit, There's I no think I'm getting a, a light-sided point now. <laughs> Fuck. You may ask. Did Atris ever mention me? She said you betrayed the Jedi by going to war when it was forbidden to you. You turned on your masters, your teachings, and yourself. Going to war was necessary. That is not all she says. She says you know nothing of loyalty to any cause except your own animal instincts. And she told us why you fell to the dark side. And why was that? Atris says that you fell to the dark side in the Mandalorian Wars when you gave in to your lust for battle. Once you tasted war, you could not give it up. Is that... Mm. Mm hmm... So why didn't I keep finding in the civil war? Atris says when the Dark Lord Revan returned to oh, the Oh, I think Republic, I already did this. You did not march with them, because you had fallen so far you could no longer feel the Force. Uh, I did not march with Revan because Revan because it was not my choice. It was so it my was choice. it was a matter of choice then. If Atris has erred in her evaluation of your motivations, it might be best to inform her. I'd rather check myself with her both in stomach. What else did she accuse me of? I believe that is the extent of her expressed feelings toward you. There are variations at times, but all rise from the same foundation. Express feelings? Yes, it is difficult sometimes for others to truly speak their heart or listen to it. The words often prove difficult, or they do not come at all. All right. All right, never mind. Fuck. Can I ask you some you questions? Ask. Do you have a name? Before entering Atris's service, yes, I carried a name, as all the children of the Ichani do. Well, what was it? It is not important. My title and rank is of consequence, not my name. I take value in Atris's service, not in myself. Okay, cool, and you should. As do all slaves, if you have no value to anyone but Atris, you have no value to me. Hell yeah. We all have value in our oaths to others, and the promises we make. When we make that pledge, we are pledging ourselves to something greater. When importance is placed on the self, then by such acts the galaxy is unmade. Do you think that I... Never mind, I'll be going. Hell yeah. Alright, cool. Um, let's see. Oh yeah, shit. Step away. Shit, man. I need to find the parts of that droid. Mm, let's go to Kreia. Let's see what she's doing. You have grown strong in the Force. I can feel its touch upon you. Do wow, not let thanks. the higher mysteries blind you to others. Turning away from that which tempts you or causes you fear is not strength. Facing it is. 
I have seen you display many acts of mercy, charity in our journey. Why? Well, that's about to change now. It is instinct to me to do what is. Oh well, fuck. Even if it weakens those you help, even if it robs them of the strength needed to grow, you have been chased, hounded since our first meeting, and it has only made you stronger, more capable. Cool to see how small acts of mercy can be harmed. If you're trying to guilt me of I think you're wrong. Ah, then you have learnt nothing. Thank from you. such small things, from such critical points, the universe and its masses may be moved. That is why you must be careful in all that you do and in every choice you make. Aiding them gives you strength by taking on their challenges, but weakens them. If that is your choice, then use their dependency, feed upon it, until you have exhausted them. Then leave them. And I would view the ones you travel with much the same way. Well, then I shall view you as disposable then. Ah, now you are learning. Do you know why those we meet display such weakness? As I said, their lives are static, untested. It is only through interaction, through decision and choice, through confrontation, physical or mental, that the force can grow within you. You have seen it. You have felt it within you as you have traveled with me. The growing anger, the rage, and the power it brings. Yet the power does not build without such struggle. Through small cruelties, greater ones are born. But I did gain influence on her. <laughs> well, let me talk some yes. more. Yes, have you come with questions? Yes, I need some answers. Then ask. What's wrong with your eyes? There is nothing wrong with my sight, if that is your question. I see all that I need, though the seeing of things flesh and blood has failed me some time ago. They were distractions only. There may be a... Uh, there might be a way to heal your sight. There is nothing wrong with my eyes. They simply have atrophied from use. They are adequate to distinguish shapes, silhouettes. If need be, I could heal them, restore my sight. But sight can prove a distraction. When one relies on sight to perceive the world, it is like trying to stare at the galaxy through a crack in the door. But that is a lesson for another time. You must learn to see crude matter for what it is before the veil is lifted. I had other questions. Ask, and I will answer. Are you a Jedi or Sith? Does it matter? Of course it does. Such titles allow you to break the galaxy into light and dark, categorize it. Perhaps I am neither, and I hold both as what they are, pieces of a whole. Know that I am your teacher, and that is enough. Enough of these lies. Or what? what? Shall you kill me? Hurt me? You would only be inflicting harm on yourself. Perhaps you will keep me here on this ship, prisoner, unable to leave. Is that the way of a Jedi? We will speak more of this, I promise you. enough for today, and I must rest. Ask. Does it matter? What, what were do you, you wish to hear? That I once believed in the code of the Jedi? That I felt the call of the Sith? That perhaps once I held the galaxy by its throat? That for every good work that I did, I brought equal harm upon the galaxy? That perhaps what the greatest of the Sith Lords knew of evil they learned from me? What would it matter now? There is only so much comfort in knowing such things, and it is not who I am now. If the past is as important, huh? I still wish to hear the story. Oh, a cutscene. Oh yeah. Such a shame it's in bad quality. There are dark places in the galaxy where few tread. Ancient centers of learning, of knowledge. Oh, this is Melkor Fi. To be united by hatred is a fragile alliance at best. Dark sign. And Dark My Highness. He's practically a demon. But my will was not law. There were disagreements. 
ambition and hunger for power. There are techniques within the Force against which there is no defense. Learn from me, my mistakes, and use that knowledge to become greater than I. That is all I ask of you, and that is all I desire. In you, all my hopes rest for the future, for the Force. That's... I need more than that prayer. If it means so much to you, then this I swear to you upon my life, upon our lives, that when your training is complete, I will answer everything. There shall be no more shadows between us, only truth that exists between master and apprentice. All right, cool. So, let's go to Citadel Station now. Or Citadel, or whatever you call it. Because I think there's still some shit to do there. Yeah, cool. I'm uh, going on my own. Because maybe that droid seller has uh, some uh, part for me for the HK unit. So you know, I rather do that part. What's this? Uh, here. Let's go to there. Let's go to the apartment. Shit. He's still up there, so. Do you sell droid parts? Yes, I do. Let's see, does he have any part for my droid? For HK? Well, I can always use spikes, so. Let's buy that. Hmm, let's open this. Uh, let's equip this. You know, it's a shame that the AI isn't that good. Because uh, otherwise, no. Okay, that is. Well, you know, they will be running away. Realistically speaking. So let's check the other apartments. So this was our. So what's in here? Nothing. What's in here? Nothing. Just a locked door. So, so let's go to complex A. Ah, just the twilight. I'll go to him soon.
Let's just open this door. Hey, what are you doing in my apartment? Helping myself, what does it look like? You think I'm just gonna let you get away with this? And? If you're, sw if you're smart, you, you will. Oh, and now I'm supposed to be scared of you on top of everything else? I'm not going to take that from you. Why not? You didn't seem to have a... You're right, I guess I'll take your life too. What? You are crazy! Get you did on. Ah, so that was uh, nice. So let's see. Let's go to this guy over here. See what's wrong with him. Haha. Tu needs a man, you my lord of water. No son. What do you do here? Kawana bota yunta tanga kinamatura. Ta yaita ta bosana ansata. Unta chiwita inka ki kraya na chawanga kone. What is this uh, predicament? E jikonu ta yun yuna palawa lit basha makaranwa ni rotu guru ni chwrota. But you did. Kawana bota yunta tanga kinamatura. Of course, you did make her a slave. Dahupa, bossa curata, go juju to yoki. Dahupa, bossa curata, go juju to yoki. Hiata yamba wajiaki, yuki to tune. Perhaps I could, um, what is the price for? Ichawa te crossi visio toda si. I think I can persuade those on Tissy things our way. So, let's help this guy, but I'm pretty sure there is a dark side twist to this. So, I'm gonna go do the dark side twist. Uh, France, entertainment module. Kavadumba Munsuru Kuplalia. Who are you? Chone Mulera. Tonking a bano Jansakan. Wait. Could I look at your name? Kawana Bota Yuntata. Wait. He wants 2,000 credits, but I don't have that. So. Let me go quickly and sell some stuff. Because I don't have that money right now. Wait, that's the wrong one. Look at camera and do so run with no chat. Don't know if I'm a geek. Wanna rock or a cheat? Let's uh, sell some shit. Oh yeah, what's this? Let's sell it. Let's sell this. Holy shit. Alright, I got enough. Thank you, uh, whatever his name is. I call the half of Hera. Da Hupa, Bosa Curata, Go, Juju to Yoki, Hiata Yamba Wajiaki, Yuki Kawana Bota, Yunta Tanga Kinamatura, Tayaita, Ta Bosanan Sata. 
ta kometa ka plajia džustinge, mi ki gongo bejaste. Kun grabi la kino mulara ki ci kuta krasa kisha. Kava dumpa munsuru ku plajia wa. Bo bagaragawanda ja i tua ulwanji uma. Da hupa, bo sa kurata, go džudžutu joki. Hjata jamba wadjaki, jukito tune. Ka wana bota, junta tanga kinamatura. Ta jajta... Ka wana bota, junta... Kavadumba da kawa Kavadumba munsuru kuplalia da hupa bo sakurata go kawana bota yuta tanga kinamato kawana bota yuta tanga kidira mariko no satu to kurana slumsa heta see you I'll collect your earnings later <laughs> Yes, give them to me. Let me get away from you. I thought there was a way to get the guy Hera, or whatever his name is, to get him killed. I don't remember what uh, how you do it, but. So, well, I guess I gotta win anyways. But I wanna see what happens now. Since I did take the love of his life. So let's... I wasn't able to convince Doton had to give me a reminder. Dovre kun mili wosa slima. Kava dumpa munsuru ku plalia wa. Da hupa bosa kurata go jujutu yoki. Hiata yam. I see. Kawana bota yunta tanga kina. Tu ni. Wait, so I kind of fucked myself now, didn't I? Okay, let me search something really quick. Hmm. So let's see. Let me see. So, oh yeah, shit! I can ask. I remember. I need to go to uh, the woman from Zerka and then ask her about Dotom. Well, there's no droid over there, so rip. <coughs> but do I have to be in the favor of her? Because otherwise, rip. I simply do not have time for you. If there is nothing else. Fuck. I can't ask. So, I guess I kind of fucked myself with that. So, that's a shame. So if I did, oh fuck! So if I did it dark sided, like from all the from uh, the beginning, then I could have done this. Shit, man, that really makes me sad. Well, at least I got like I don't know. Well, rip. 
I guess. Let me go to my ship and then we'll go to Onderaan. What's this? Oh, nothing. So that's not that's the wrong. That's the wrong. Let's go to on the round, shall we? this that that look like a republic ship right there oh shit that's a lot of ships I bet we're getting fired at or we're gonna get fired at well this is Onderon Looks like there's a long line to get into the Isis starport. Something feels wrong here. A great disturbance here in orbit, and again on the planets below. I guess this blockade is a symptom of larger problems on Onderon. Looks like we're about to find out. I'm receiving a message from some Colonel Tobin, patching it through. The Ebon Hawk. I was told to expect your arrival. I don't know your business on Onderon, but it ends here. Oof. Rip. The Ebon Hall. We've taken some hits. We can try to fight back, or I can outrun them and hide us on the jungle moon nearby. It's your call. We better run for it to the moon. You know, just once I wish someone was glad to see us. But no, if it isn't weapons pointed at our heads, it's someone trying to blast us out of the sky. Yep. How bad needs the ship damage? It's taken a little damage, nothing too serious. I'm shutting down all unnecessary systems until we make repairs. It'll keep us from being a target. Uh, enough of this, how soon can we... Until the ship is repaired, we're not going anywhere. Unless you can find another route to Onderon, we should sit tight. There may be a means to get to Onderon by another route. The Force has guided us here for a reason. We should explore our surroundings. There is... something here. Something? Oh, there's something here, all right. Predators. Not small flit darters, but big, mean, nasty predators. Nevertheless, we should explore our surroundings. And that nearby <coughs> outpost would be as good a place as any to begin. Only route the jungle. Well, if you go, be careful. No telling what other ships were forced down in the battle. I have a feeling the ship will not be repaired until our business here is concluded. Do I make myself clear? Yeah, I understand. What's so important about this place? This is where the Mandalorian Wars began. He fought here once, and there are things here he must see. He fought here? Why didn't he say anything? Do you speak of all your battles? Or are there some you wish to forget? That's true. So let's leave. Let's take her and her. Yes. Let's go.
Let us end this. Oh, yeah. Good one. Nothing much I can do for the ship. <laughs> Not at all, actually. So many of these animals, holy shit. So let's see. This is the only way, so. I love that sarcasm. Sarcasm. Oh, 
Oh, a bunch of duros, I think. There's no way I'm going to surrender to you. Any remains? Oh, Mandalorian heavy armor. That's that's good to learn. the ship escape? I will deal with your failure later, Captain. But for now, find that ship. Our ally has indicated that the Jedi hasn't left the system yet. Send a detachment to Duxon. If you find anything, alert me immediately. Now get out of my sight. All right. Cool. Let's see. All right, boys, I'm gonna stop it here. <laughs>